Wow. I'm a math guy. <clears throat> I'm a math guy, dude. Uh, I'm part of the July unemployment numbers, like I said before, and since then, uh, I haven't been shaving too much. Uh, my girl kind of digs this ugly look, man. I, I really don't like this at all. I think I want to shave tomorrow. But I'm a really good math guy. Um, you know, I understand a few things with math. Um, but this, this is crazy. I can't understand this. Like, I can do all kinds of calculations in my head, and I understand math to the T. I understand that, you know, a thousand million is a billion, and a thousand billion is a trillion, you know. This is nuts. Uh, you want to go to usdebtclock.org. And I'm going to show you this right here. Okay, let me pull up my camera so I understand what I'm shooting at here. There we go. Okay, let me put this down. usdebtclock.org. It is a running tally of everything that's going on right now. The U.S. national debt, look at that, dude. It's 400,000, 500,000. That was 100,000 right there. What? 600,000. So we're looking at 11 trillion, 693 billion, 612 million. Sorry, 613 million right now. But now it's 613 million, 100,000 right now. And now it's getting up to 200,000 right now. And you gotta be kidding me, dude. Debt per citizen right there is at 38,000. Spending per citizen is at 8,000. Like, look at this. The, the one down there says uh, US spending calendar to date. So I don't even know what that means, but look at just look at all these numbers real quick. It, they just update all the freaking time. <laughs> If you hear me laughing right now, it's because I don't get it. If I understood these numbers, I would stand up, scream, race down to Washington, D.C. on an airplane right now and show this website to Congress and just rip out my hair and scream and say, what the fuck is going on here, dude? I mean, I thought the U.S., debt ceiling was 11.4 and then they want to get it up to 12.1 well by this standard right here when is that top number when's that gonna say 12 you know pretty damn soon man look at this financial meltdown it says u.s government bailouts that can't be u.s government bailout spending i'm serious when i say that we haven't spent 11 trillion on u.s bailouts you kidding me? U.S. private debt? What does that mean, man? You know what I mean? Like, I don't even understand half these numbers. You can't look at this and not flip out. Um, yeah, and when we first looked at this, I think it was 613 million, and now it's 616 million. Right here, that 616 right there. And so we're three more million in debt just from this fucking video. That means... Actually, I'm afraid if I tell you what that means, that there's going to be civil unrest right now. I don't want that. So I'm going to let you figure out what that means. But in the meantime, think about this for a second. It cost you 20 bucks to get 20 gallons of, what is it, Crystal Geyser bottled water. I mean, if I go to Albertsons or something, I think it's a dollar a bottle, a dollar a gallon for 10 gallons if you buy 10 at a time. Okay, so if you buy 20 at a time, it's 20 bucks. What the f is 20 bucks to you? Well, I know that's relative. 20 bucks is a lot to some people. and Not right now. Please, please, just give me two minutes. So, um... 20 gallons is nothing. Oh, I'll take them. Okay. Hey, buddy. Come here, bud. Sorry about that. 20 gallons is 20 gallons, right? 20 gallons of water. What's 20 gallons of water to you in a situation where your water's been shut off? Everybody's water's been shut off. At, in an emergency type situation, someone wants you 
a mandatory evacuation to go to your local elementary school to get your water voucher and your food voucher and you get in your little tent and you get with your family. So they shut down all electricity to all homes. They shut down the water to the homes. They shut down the gas, shut down all your utilities to your home. What are you going to do without water? But think what you could do with that 20 gallons. If you got like four people, 20 gallons of water lasts you at least three, four, or five days, depending on you know how much you drink and stuff like that. They say a gallon of water uh, per day per person, but you know you can ration a little bit. You can do a little government rationing. You know what I mean? Hey, uh, you know you've had a half a gallon today. Uh, you know, you know government rationing. You know what I'm talking about. Sorry, that shit just strikes a nerve in me right now. But 20 bucks, nothing to you, but 20 gallons of water in an emergency situation. So just buy your freaking 20 gallons now. Set it somewhere in a closet, in a nice cool area, and just let it sit there and forget about it. And that way, when something does happen, man, you got that 20 gallons there. I mean, you do it now or you do it at the time when everyone else is doing it and everybody else is at the freaking store at the same time. They're all clawing each other's shit out, you know? Why don't you go watch the movie, um, either The Mist or Mist, you know, where these people are locked in a freaking supermarket for like five, six days straight and they don't even know what's going on. When lives are on the line, you know, you start figuring out who people are. And uh, I want to find out who people are on my emergency radio at home with my water, my food. I got my stove here. I got propane. I got all the food I could want. I got everything. Like, imagine camping inside your home. Because that's what you're going to have to do for a little bit. Maybe. Maybe. At least that's what the, uh, you know, I read some of the documents from the Department of Homeland Security. They recommend an emergency radio. They recommend the things that I'm telling you. I'm not, uh, I'm not making this up. Go get some extra water. Go get some extra food. Just in case. Why not? Because look at those fucking numbers. Remember this video? Remember that shit? It was at 613 and then 616. Now it's at 624. 624 million. This country is $10 million more in debt just for me making this fucking video right here. Can you comprehend that? I don't think you can. Because I sure as hell can't and I'm fucking awesome with math. I can't even comprehend that fucking number. Can you?